Nothing like coming back to the range after a big day of grind. Actually, it was more than one day. I'm full of stuff, full of goodies, and I'm cranking up a lot of bricks. Because, oh yeah, but that's pretty cool. Imagine having this thing for all this apple trees and stuff. So, I'm cranking up a lot of bricks because I'm gonna try a new tool. I'm gonna try to build a brick building and it's gonna be right here. And it's gonna be like a barbecue kitchen area. So let's see how it goes. Welcome to Outlaws of the Old West. So, as I mentioned before, I went on a bit, a little bit of a grind. A look at all the stuff that I got. That's pretty sweet. I collected a lot of trees. I found myself a little bit of a, of a forest with a lot of trees connected. So I took the opportunity to grab myself more trees because I'm cranking also a lot of planks because building is still in the works. I'm still gonna build a lot of stuff and I'm actually gonna crank up more planks like can I do 500? No. What about 300? Oh yeah, crank it all up. I still got a lot of wood in the horse. So I'm just gonna park everything and after that let's start building some more. Uh, uh Bobby, are you okay? Is that horse uh, uh, cramping up your space? I think he is. What the hell's going on? Is that a new friend? Okay, man. If you don't, if you don't have any problems, I don't have any problems. That's really good. So, interesting thing. I also found a new gang called the Skull Gang, and I got some gold bars out of them. It was four guys. I killed them all. They seem to have better clothes. I think they were like a tier up uh, gang, maybe. I don't know. But I don't think I encountered them before, and they go gave, They gave me gold gold coins I don't know if it counts as money maybe I can just buy stuff with the gold bars or I have to smelt them down into in making coins or something I don't know it's the first time I got gold bars but it's pretty damn sweet so yeah I got still more stuff here I also increased a little bit my weight capacity and my accuracy I had four points and uh, I didn't notice if he actually increases the amount of things I can carry. I think it's just the weight, but I'm not sure. So, Bobby, yeah, you got yourself a new friend. That's, uh, I, actually, I actually like it. Got something to, to give you company while I'm away. But it's pretty cool. Oh boy, now I don't think it's a friend. It's a goddamn black bear. What the hell are you doing, dude? There you go. At this range, this sniper rifle is just a menace. Yeah, that's right. There you go. So, definitely I need to give some protection to Bobby. Because this thing is starting to become a little bit... A little bit of a situation around here. And they seem to come from this side. Yeah, I think they're targeting Bobby. So, I got myself 150 bricks. I think I'm also gonna crank up some more iron bars. Uh... I got myself some coal, iron bar. Let's do another 20. Ignite. I think 8 should be enough to like to keep this thing burning. Okay, so this thing started to be a little crammed up. I'm also gonna have to think about doing more storage to separate things. Like one storage just for wood, another storage just for plants, another for seeds. Something along those lines. But for now, I'm just going to park everything away, as it is. I got myself a stove. And the tool that I was kind of looking for. Yeah, I think I'm going to put these nice tools over here. The hammer. Uh, this thing should, could also be useful. And I got this hammer. I got the, the first log mallet. I got this claw hammer. I also got some... And this is the thing the brick lane tool. I kind of think, I kind of thought that you would need clay to make bricks, but actually not. It's just stone. There you have it. That's how I managed to do 150, because stone it's quite easy to get. So actually uh, uh, a viewer uh, called Lone Star actually told me once that clay is not useful at all. But there's a thing that you can do with clay, which is adobe. But I haven't found the tool 
that actually uses Adobe to build something. So for now, I'm gonna keep the clay. I don't know. Maybe you should, you, you tar. I can make tar to make a street. Oh, that's pretty sweet. There's a lot of stuff to do yet. So let's just grab a few planks too. Because I'm probably gonna need them. And let's see. Let's go over there to that side. Let's park up the sharp. It's a really cool weapon. And <laughs> I still haven't placed down the, the chicken the chicken coop. I'm still thinking if I'm gonna place them inside the barn or just use the barn as storage and put chicken coops kind of like here maybe. And uh, I could I, I should also destroy these walls. Yeah, I should have the sledgehammer in hand too. Let's put it on number seven and let's take these things apart. Nice, I should have some resources back. Pretty cool. Oh, I broke the sledgehammer. Oh, goddammit. I'm gonna have to make a new one. As I'm waiting for the sledgehammer, which is almost done, I'm also looking at there's a lot of cool stuff here, like an ice box. I could do like a fridge. There's also a fridge, actually. There's some pretty cool lamps, a lot of diversity. And there's a, some nice safes, which I think should be kind of cool to keep uh, the gold bars. And there's pet pans. I think I'm gonna do pans too. A metal spoon, a frying pan, what else? A metal bowl, a pot, another pot, and another pot. What is this? To break down items. Interesting. Street lamp. These street lamps are gonna be pretty cool also in the, in the ranch. Spreading them all over, making like a nice path all over the the brain, the ranch. Mailbox, a sword. I haven't tried melee in this game. I should. A metal town bell. This seems to be the only stove. I was kind of looking for some more kitchen items. Spurs. Oh, I should do spurs too. Is this a pair or just one? Let's see. Let's do two. A candle. Oh, an ice axe. I think I'm gonna do this thing because I'm probably gonna go also to the to the snow biome to try to get myself some nice. And uh, actually, let's build the uh, 30 item bars. That's quite expensive. And a nice box. Yeah, let's just craft all these things, and eventually I'll use them somehow. So these are the. The kitchen utensils, pretty cool. Those things can stay right there. Let's see if I got some more bars coming. Yeah, I got some more. Nice. So let's see. Let's go to the character and see where I put the spurs. So is this it? Let's see if I right click where he goes. Uh, where are the damn spurs? There you are. He made a sound. Where did he go? Is it here? I don't know. Is it on the boots? It seems like the spurs are in. Look, my boots. Yeah, it seems like the spurs are over there. Pretty cool. So, I don't know, will this make the horse go faster? I have to try it sometime. But for now, I got the bricks. I believe I have everything. Let me just check. So, number eight. I can make like a jail, and these doors should be kind of cool to use, definitely. And the foundations, they take brick planks and iron bars. Oh, that's a good thing I was cranking more iron bars, because this is going to be quite expensive. For the walls, it's just bricks. And the ceilings, it's planks and iron bars. Jesus, man. This is no joke. Still no corner uh, uh, ceiling, though. Yeah, let me see how many iron bars I got. Maybe I should... yeah, 24. I don't think it's gonna cut it. Let me just crank up some more iron bars, because I, because I do have quite a bit of iron now. And it's 5 each, so 20, 40, 60, 80. Let's do 100. Let's do 100 iron bars. There you go. And I think I'm gonna need more coal, definitely. So let's put a little bit more. Uh, let's grab a stack. 
and the coal doesn't yield as much like each stone gives me something like uh, 20 coal at best let's take out I don't know 20 this is done yeah it seems like this thing stopped by itself or did I stop it by mistake I don't know let's put 20 I think should be enough maybe let's just leave the rest right here uh, yeah I'm gonna keep some iron with me maybe it's it's it should be useful uh, yep let's go over there then let's see I'm probably gonna remove those foundations that I have over there and place these ones or I could just fill it up with normal foundations just to save on on bricks. The thing is, I don't know if then... Let's see if I can place a wall on top of these foundations. Oh yeah. But... I mean, is that a problem having bricks on top of wood? Because it has stone need. I don't think that will be a problem. I don't have a problem with it. So let me just fill this up with, with foundations. And then, you know, if I have to remove some, I, do, I remove it, no problem. I got a brand new sledgehammer. And, uh, you know, I'm kind of addicted to, the, to this game's building. It's just so fun. It works so nicely. And, you know, I got myself a nice little thing here. And I think I'm gonna also do... Something, something cool, like... something coming out now the question is can I attach a oh yeah look at that I can attach it to the over there hmm that's interesting let's try it let's just let it go like so and let's do another triangle one. Uh, I think there's no problem having it like that. And it would be kind of cool to be symmetrical. So I have one. Uh, let's grab the other one. One, two. No, let's just start by the other side. And it should line up eventually. So let's put one like this. And let's go square one. That's pretty cool. So I put two. Can I place it? Oh, maybe it's too deep. Yeah. It might be too deep. I'm not sure. Can I place it underneath? Hmm. What if I try to put a pillar? Will it help? Oh yeah, it's hanging. See? It's kinda hanging. I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to put... Oh, I can put one underneath. Nice. Oh yeah, let's put it. Problem solved, I think. Now it's just a matter of being able to... Do you go over there? Where do I have to look? Can I go from here? It's weird, now it doesn't want to connect to here. Hmm. It's a bit of a conundrum. Goddamn lock foundations. What the hell is wrong? Maybe I put the other one wrong? What is it? It's a little weird. Why don't you connect there, dude? Okay, let's continue from this side then. No. Oh god, okay. Like this. And then another one. I can't. Uh, let's try, can you go? Let's see if I can put it like that, okay. Ah, oh, it's gonna be hard. Doesn't go there now. Well, instead of using foundations, maybe I could use just these things. 
Oh, it's foundation. Just the same. Yep. I was thinking in terms of ceilings. What's the difference between these two? Oh, it's a bit more curved. Gotcha. Mm, but now it's a bit weird, as in now let me put it over there. Let's try to remove this one. And let's try again. Okay, so I can put one on these, that's fine. But now it doesn't connect over that, that one. That's a little weird. <sighs> oh, it would be kinda cool to have like a path right here. But it doesn't really want it. What if I put this one? It's connecting to something else. I think it's the things underneath. Yeah. Oh man, that's such a shame. I came across something cool and now I can't do it. Okay, so I managed to do it, but I just had to use ceilings instead of foundations. Of course, it's I had to place down some pillars to hold it out. And uh, it's looking pretty cool. And then I just put some railings, you know, it's just a nice place to, to walk around and stuff. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to place down railings over there. Let's see. Because they're kind of finicky in where they go. But I think, it, it, yeah, it goes. At least on that one. Okay. Nice. Here it's a bit tricky because I got some corner, some triangle pieces uh, overlapping, but it seems to be working. Oh yeah, nice. And here, who knows? Uh, let's see. I don't think I'm gonna be able to place it there. Yeah, it goes on this side. Maybe I just have to find the good angle, the right angle. Yeah. I don't know. I can work something out, place something over there later. Well, let's just close that thing over there. There you go. So now, let's see what we can do here. I figure, like, an entrance from this side. And, um... I'm kind of thinking, barbecue downstairs, kitchen upstairs. And the downstairs area is going to be kind of open. Let's see. Okay, I got the ceiling. This is pretty much the same. Door, some fence, some rails. Okay, some nice windows. Pretty cool. Pillars. That's sweet. So let's take a look at the walls. Let's start putting down some walls. Um, so I figure it should be open to the river. And this doesn't doesn't have to be too big. Well, let's just put like one wall there. So how many spaces are left? Two. And uh, which side did I put it? I placed it on the... It's on the second block. It's on the second block. So here and here. There you go. Yeah, it doesn't have to be bigger than this. Um, let's see what other walls we got. No curved walls. I got these things, which I think it's like a balcony. They kind of look like a, a little balcony. I could do like a bar or something. These things have certain amount of decoration. Uh, they will look kind of cool, like on the inside. I don't know if this is supposed to be on the inside or the outside, but I think it's in the inside. And, got a, and I got a horse flipping out over there. What the hell's going on? Dude, there's Bobby over there. Go talk to him. He's a good boy. So. I don't think I'm going to need windows to watch the sheep. 
maybe just one. Why not? I mean, I'm a farmer. I like to watch my sheep. So maybe... Yeah, a window right here in the middle. And a couple more windows here. Another window here. And another window over there. How about that? Here, let's close it off with some walls. There you go. And another wall there. And here is going to be the entrance. Which... This front side is going to be open. But I think I should put the door anyway. Let's see if I can put in a few windows. Where is the bend windows? Blanking glass. I don't have glass. Yeah, that's right. So glass takes for later. Uh, there you go. So this is going to be like a barbecue area. So imagine I just came in. Uh, I could have like a flight of stairs just right over there. So let's see if I can put some stairs. These are quite big. They could also go kind of like this. I could just remove that window. And... Uh, or like this. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have it like this, because this way I climb over, I turn around and the kitchen is facing the the the, um, the river. Let's just remove, let's see if I get something back out of this. And, yep, I got eight, bri eight bricks back. How many does it take to build one? Ten bricks. Okay, it's not all, but it's most of it. Pretty good. Uh, okay, so let's put some ceilings here. Brick ceiling. This doesn't look like brick. But it's pretty cool nonetheless. Let's just close this thing out. Like so. Can I pass through? Oh yeah, I can pass through. No issues whatsoever. Nice, I like it. So it's kind of looking cool already. Maybe the stairs are a little, a little too big. Let's see if I can get uh, some thinner stairs. No, not this one with number eight. Uh, these are half ones. I got these ones. Oh, they end up kind of neat, but it's gonna occupy the same space. Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna leave that one. I think I'm gonna leave that one. So up here, let's just continue the walls a little bit more. If there are half walls, it will also be kinda cool to have like half walls here. I can place them on that side. He doesn't seem to want to go here on the edge. Okay. Could also use these ones right here. Like as a bar. I could have like a bar here. Hmm. Like. Could have like the barbecue here. Not sure. But I think for the kitchen this should be pretty cool. Like, like these ones. Unfortunately, there's no window with this one. So I think I'm gonna put a window here. And another one over there. And some pillars, I think, are gonna be required. So I got these brick pillars. Which block is it? It's right on the middle. Okay. I could put here next to the stairs. I think they look... It's a good nice spot. Yeah, here in the middle I think it's it's good. Because I have to be right on the edge. Let's just put some more walls. Uh, like, this one's on the back.
And uh, I'm out of bricks. Yep. <laughs> Takes a lot of them bricks. Let's see if I can do a little bit more. And I don't think these dudes are eating at all from this thing because I had... This thing is just spoiling. I don't think they're eating. I'm not sure what I'm gonna have to do to give them something. These dudes are not drinking. I don't know. But... Yeah, I think eventually they just gonna die of hunger and thirst. And I hope the hunger and thirst takes longer to go back to zero than the resource thing takes to go back to 100. Because, yeah. But even so, I'm, a, I'm, I'm, I'm still gonna plant down a few of these things. Uh, you know. I could just put it in place of this thing. That would be kinda cool. So, you know what? I think I'm gonna put it right here in the middle. One right there. And uh, for the cows, I think. One right here. Nice. Do I have food? No, I do not. I got a lot of thimble berries, so let's just grab a few thimble berries. I should have quite a few around here. Let's see. Oh, that's a lot of them thimble berries. Look at this. I don't know if they eat them. I mean, it's a fruit. Should be healthy. Should be good. And yeah, I broke the sledgehammer before I finished that thing. So let's just put thimble berries inside here. Okay, it's showing up food. Nice. Okay, that's all I can do for nobodies. You don't eat. I don't know what to do. I definitely don't. So let's leave it like this. That's a lot of them thimble berries. Yeah, I'm still waiting for the things to, to cook. I should also do some glass. But for the time being, I'm just going to leave this stuff right here. And let's see how many bricks we got. 18 bricks. That should be enough for something. Also cooking up some more of these iron bars because I'm definitely pretty sure I'm going to need more of them for something else. For other buildings. So let's just see if at least I can finish up the, the framage. Let's see if I can do the framage here. What about these walls right here? Yeah, let's put them in. Why not? And I'm out. Takes 10 each. God damn bricks, man. And I figure we should also have some ruins here, right? So that people don't just fall over to the river. I think. But now, I'm not sure if I can place it on the inside. Let's see. Let me just move the first person. Over there I can. Here I can. Oh, I just saw it. Nice. Here, maybe a small one. Let's see. Nice. And... There's another one. Actually, this thing also has railings. Yeah, maybe I could have used these ones. It's just two planks and an iron bar. Oh, they're smaller. Do you fit over there? Maybe kinda cool. They're, oh, goddammit. <laughs> I still got these foundations down here. I wasn't... I, I, I did the ramp to try to reach them, but I couldn't really. So, I don't think there's a problem if they stay there. That's fine. But uh, these railings kinda have their own personality. So, maybe it's not too bad. Let's see. No. No. There you go. Right here. Maybe I just need to put another ceiling here with the side that accepts the railing right there. I think I sh maybe I could have overlap it. Let's see.
I think it's going in the same position, yeah. Let's try to put one normal one. Now they're going in the diagonal. Am I in third or in first person? Right, let's go third person. I don't think I'm gonna be able to. Let's try the other one, the 45. Let's see. So you show up there. Yeah, but it's not the position that I would prefer. No, it's not that block. Okay. That's fine. At least it's 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 almost enclosed. It's not perfect. Maybe I just should add a few pillars down there. Uh, yeah. Both railings connecting to the same one. That's that's fine. And down there. Nice. And what about on that side? Yeah, another pillar there. Those ones already have one. Yeah, that's good. Okay, so it's not completed, but the idea is in. And I think it's gonna look pretty cool. It's just a matter of finishing off these walls and let and let's see, do the ceilings also take Planks and iron bars. So I can just stop putting these ones in. Yeah. Just a simple, a simple roof. I got myself a little bit more bricks. Let's see if this I can do. I can do that side. So here, oh yeah, maybe here I should put one of these walls. Yeah. And here I could do like a half wall. Yeah, and a pillar. Set of pillars here. Go in the middle. So I got a pillar right here. So maybe I could just continue. Like so. Maybe like that. This way I'm gonna have a nice little view. And let's see these walls. Let's see if I have enough. Uh brick wall try no. Oh. Five bricks. I'm already out of them. God damn bricks, man. Jesus. But I can put the roof. So let's put the roof. So it's this one. Like so. It's connecting to the pillar. Nice. Right there. Sweet. And here. I should I should able to maybe put these ones. Need support. Yeah. I'm not sure if it's connecting nicely. Then I have to check. Here, I think I need the wall to give support to this side. Yeah. I think I do because here it goes. Let's see from the outside if it actually connects well. I'm not sure. Seems like it's going in when it should also actually be coming out. Yeah, I'm not sure. Let's see, let's see if the wall it lines up better. So even with the wall, this thing is saying that it needs pillars. So 
Let's just try to put a pillar. If I could put it like right next to the wall, that would be nice. I think it's going kind of inside the wall actually. Yeah. Is it showing on the outside? It's a little weird. I mean, it's a brick wall. It doesn't hold it. Yeah, let's put on the corners. I think it looks cool. Yeah, like so. Let's put here. And I'm probably out of bricks. Yeah. <laughs> well, there you go. It's looking kind of cool. I don't know. Some changes will be done for sure. I I never ha I never get it first time, but it's a new addition to the thing. And uh, hopefully for the next episode, I'll have this thing more decorated and stuff, and will look more like a kitchen barbecue area. But for now, oh, let's see if I can get a nice angle. There you go. Thank you for watching, and until next time.